Some sad news coming out of the esports world today as we learn that a professional gamer has been shot down in cold blood over their PS4. So 28-year-old Danny, also known as Phobos, is a MLG Gears of War player. He had decided that he was going to post up his unwanted console on Craigslist. He was wanting to get rid of his PlayStation 4. So we had some potential buyers show up Tuesday morning. So Tuesday morning, Phobos is sitting there talking with his Gears of War teammates. And he tells them, hey guys, I'll be right back. So he goes downstairs to meet with potential buyers, people he thinks are interested in buying the PlayStation 4. When he gets down there, he meets up with 20-year-old Nathaniel Vivian. He's the boyfriend. He's the driver. Also in the car is his 16-year-old girlfriend. Also in the car is their 16-month-old baby, which means this chick was like 15 or 14 when she got knocked up. So as Phobos walks down with his PlayStation 4, the driver, the male driver, tries to grab the console from his hands. Phobos wouldn't let go of the PlayStation 4. He realized he was being robbed. He tried to hold on to it. There was a struggle. The 16-year-old then grabbed a gun, pulled the trigger. The bullet went through her boyfriend's hand and into Danny's chest where he died. The couple then tried to go to the hospital to have the man's hand looked at, and that's where they were ended up uh, being arrested and uh, the 16-year-old will be charged as an adult. You know, shit like this is just really sad and pathetic. Um, I hate thieves. I hate people who take other people's belongings. You know, if, if you're the type of person that can't go get a job like everybody else and... You have to try to take something that somebody else worked for. You're trash. $400, these people will spend, if not the rest of their lives, which I hope they do, but if not the rest of their lives, a good portion of their lives in prison over a $400 piece of plastic. Really sad. But you got to be careful anytime you're dealing with people you don't know about especially on sites like Craigslist where you're dealing with people face-to-face -face because there are some crazy sons of bitches out there and there's a lot of trash out there. There's plenty of good people too, but you still have to be careful and watch out. And if you sell anything on Craigslist, please meet in a very, very public place. Meet right in front of Walmart. Meet right in front of a huge crowd of people where there's cameras and everything everywhere. Most of the time, crazy shit isn't going to go on in those types of situations. But if you're meeting in an apartment uh, parking lot, you know, where it's dark or whatever else, you know, all kinds of stuff can go wrong. And it's just not worth it. It's not worth your life to sell something in a place that isn't safe. So just make the extra step, drive down the road to some, you know, public place and make sure you do some deal if that's the way you do it. You know, I choose to do everything like through eBay, so I don't want to deal with anybody face to face. Um, but that's just my take. So anyway, very sad news. If you want to read more about it, links down in the description box. And hopefully these people will rot in prison because to me this is intent to murder. You know, you showed up with the intention of a robbery. The intention was to take the PS4 without paying for it. And you also brought a gun and somebody died. You bring a gun to a robbery, somebody dies. To me, that's intent to commit murder. So anyway, I hope these assholes get everything and more. And they should have plenty of time to think about that PS4. That does it for me, The Red Dragon. Links down in the description box if you want to read more about it. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.